Today I'll be making the best lineups for every month, play against each other in three different phases. Find out which month has the best football players. I've already made the teams for each month. We have January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November and December. In each phase, more and more months will get eliminated until we get to phase three, where we find out what month has the best football player. Now in phase one, we'll be dividing the 12 months into six games by spinning on wheel to randomly pick two teams at a time to find out each match. Once we know the matchups, the teams will play their game and out of the six games, only six winners will go on to phase number two. Okay, so for the first game, who we're gonna have? We're gonna have a little bit of January. And who's January gonna be playing against? August. First game, you see he's won as well for January. Luis Diaz finally inside the box and he finishes far post. Lorente with a beautiful finish to make it 1 0. Second goal is also a beautiful one between the three players. Beautiful play. Vlaovic finds the second and to make it 3 0 to end the game off. Vlaovic scores the 3 0. All right, moving on to game number two is going to be June. And who's June going to be playing against? It's going to be March. Second game, neither of the teams could find the back of the net in 120 minutes. So penalty shoot out. Ramos misses the Panenka. Salas scores a beautiful goal. Top right corner of the net. He goes Rakitic. Is he gonna score? Is he gonna miss? He does the Panenka and he misses. Now De Bruyne, is he gonna score? And he does it so calmly. Left side of the goal and he scores his 2-0 right now. Can Griezmann score this one? And he cannot. It is saved. Neuer time. If he saves, they stay in. If he does not save, then Pellegrini will put his team through to the phase two. And he does. Noya gets to the right side, but still goes in. Pellegrini puts his team to phase number two. With game one and two done, we'll move on to game number three. That's going to be December. And December is going to be playing against September. Game number three is off with a beautiful finish near post by the Frenchman. Number nine, Benzema. But then Bruno Fernandes finds the equalizer just minutes after. Although it is not enough. 90th minute, the number nine scores a near post finish to make his team win the game. We move on to game number four. That is going to be July. And July is going to be playing against October, May. Game number four, neither of the teams can find back in the net in 120 minutes once again. But Kane scores his first penalty for his team. He goes Richardson. Can he score his goal? And he cannot. He misses terribly during the Panenka. Now goes Haaland. Can he score? He does. Beautifully done. Bottom left corner of the net. Usman Dembele steps up. Can he score the first penalty for his team? And he does. Bottom left as well. Now here goes Yumin Son. Can he score? Can he not? And he does. Beautifully done. It is too easy for this team to score penalties. Gakpo steps up. Is he going to score? And he doesn't. Beautiful save from the keeper. Now goes Courtois. If he saves, he team stays in the game. If he doesn't, it's a win for the other team. Gnabry steps up and he scores. December wins the game and they move on to phase number two. Two spins to go, four names left. This is going to be game five, February. And who is February going to be playing against? February is going to be playing against April. Game number five off the beautiful set piece for Marquinhos. Two Dumfries inside the box. He scores a beautiful header to make his team go 1 0. Although Neymar finds Ronaldo inside the box with a beautiful finish. First time finish to make it 1 1. Minutes later in the game, the defense makes a mistake. Milan Visavich finds Immobile for the 2 1. Immobile wins the game for February to put them into phase two. Which of course means for the final game, we're going to have November against October. No need of spinning. Let's move on to the game. Game number six. Last game of phase one. Felix finds back in net in extra time. Rashford, he finds Kessa to equalize the game. In extra time, we'll move on to penalty, ladies and gentlemen, for being the first one to take it. And he scores. We move on. Second pen taker. Dybala, can he score? He's also going to save. And he saves Alisson. Marcos Rashford to make it 2-0 for his team. And he does. Left side once again. He scores his penalty. It's time for Brozovic. Can he score? No. Alisson saves. Ibrahimovic. Is he going to score? Of course he does. It's too easy for him. The top or toppest. It is Ibrahimovic who scores the third penalty. Now it is time for Alisson. If he saves, his team 
moves on phase two. Is he gonna save? He does not. Lamar scores his penalty to the right side of the net. De Gea, can he save this penalty? Keep his team in the game, or is Abraham gonna score to put his team in phase number two? He scores left side. He puts his team in phase number two, and that is it. Phase two is done. And just like that, these are the six months they're gonna stay in and move on to phase two, one step close to that final. And now moving on to phase two, this is still very similar to phase one, where teams are gonna go head to head against each other to see who goes through to phase three. This time instead though, it's not gonna be 11 v 11, it's gonna be Volta style 5v5. And once again, we're gonna randomize the teams, see who plays who, and then by the end of phase two, there's gonna be only three teams remaining for that grand finale now for the first game in phase two in volta we're going to be having january and who's january going to be playing against january is going to be playing against june in the first game of volta first game phase two the keeper cannot save him it's a rebound for savage to make it one nil for his team although mesler muhammad salah with the easiest finish past the keeper party makes it two one and then to end it off for the June team, Party makes the 3 and 1 and they move on. Now, game 1 is set. What we're going to be having for game number 2? It's going to be October. And out of 3 months, who's October going to be playing against? It's going to be October against February. Okay. Really easy game for October in this one. Rasha finds the 1 0 after luck rebound. And then Trent as well finds the rebound to make it 2 0. They move on. Now, of course, for the last game, no need to store. As you can see, it's going to be December against July for game number 3. Of phase two game the three for the first goal homos with a diver head that makes it one nil but then minutes later Holland steals the ball can he score of course that with the easiest finish he makes it one one but then minutes later Aussie man with a beautiful strike to make it two one and he wins the game for his team they move on and just like that now from 12 months we're down to the final three months June October and December and soon enough, we'll find out in phase three, what month makes you the best footballer. And now that we have our three finals ready to get into the final to find out what month makes you the best footballer, please consider to subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. I'd really appreciate it and thank you. Now moving on to phase three, the grand finale. Let me explain how this is gonna work. We cannot play one game as we did with the others to decide the winner of the challenge because you have three teams. So one game just would not work. So I decided, you know what, let's do career mode. As you can see right now on the screen, I'm United right now, but United is not, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. The three teams we're looking at is Southampton, who's July, it is Everton, which is December, and finally it's um, Bournemouth, who's July. Those are the three teams we're looking at, because we're going to sim an entire season and see at the end of it who gets... The most points who finishes high up the table whoever does that wins the challenge and that's it i think this is the best way the most perfect way to go about it the most fair way because they play the exact same games the same amount of games one season and that's it so without further ado we're gonna go quickly to the calendar and we're just gonna sim it we're just gonna sim it so i'll be back in a second to see who wins the challenge and here we have it the final of the season after three phases, 12 months turn into six, then from six in turn into three. And now we're about to find out the number one, the month that represents the best footballers. As you can see, I'm going to back out of this. I'm going to go to central. And when I go to standings, we might see actually you already won the challenge because it's going to show me where United is in the table. And if any of the three clubs are around United, we're going to see it. So. In three, in two, in one. Wait, born. Wait, so Bournemouth is eighth. Oh shit, Southampton is fourth. Which means where? Which there's three. There's Southampton, Bournemouth, and and Everton. Unless Everton got top three, Southampton is the winner. Again, Bournemouth is July, Everton is December, and Southampton is October. So unless Everton got top three so them to which is again october won the challenge three two one hold up hold up oh there we go everton is number one which means everton which was december december is the best month 
for footballers. There you go. And now, if you enjoyed this video, like, comment. And again, if you enjoyed this, you're going to enjoy this one as well. Thank you. Peace out.